Hi guys, it's time to make a roundup of the last days of work. A few days ago, ARC KDE, that's the correct name. Let's have a look at the sources. I wanted to go to the internet, but let's uh, use the tools, right? You have the PAMAC, our PAMAC, Arclex PAMAC all, that will be always supported and have these nice icons with Flatpak, etc. support. We have a new or the Papyrus theme, right? Let's give credit to those who deserve it. Arc KDE is the theme for KDE Plasma 5 coming from, and that's why I wanted to go to the internet to give thanks, credits, right? Arc KDE is from Papyrus. Now, this is the theme you will get um, when you install Plasma and use this one. But as um, usual, there are many with this change, right? There were not that many releases. Look at that. <clears throat> 2022-0603. And now we have our own Arclex look. And the previous was then 2018, right? Four years ago. So I'm glad there is a new um, update. So it's, it's, it's maintained. But as usual, um, many people with the new changes, the new theme, people have um, questions. This, why this, why that, can I change this, can I change that? And exactly the same thing I went through. So we've created an Arconix Arc KDE on the shoulders of the developers of Papyrus, all credits to them. But of course, they are the Papyrus icon developers. We have the Sardi and the Surfen icons. So when I was testing it out, I saw that a few icons there that I did not like in here. So the shutdown and logout and all these things here were theirs, their idea of having an icon for those uh, elements. As well, if you go for a, sorry, a super X, right? And you log out stuff like that, these icons were not these. So what you can do always, and that's Linux, that's the power of Linux, you can change anything. Right. So we've developed our own theme. And while I was busy with all that, I saw, well, we created our own surfing. Let's have a look at the summary here. I've created my own icons, right? So icons, that's where we started in time wise. Uh, the project started with this, I believe, surfing, plasma, dark, but the tele folders, the tele folders are these guys. Okay, so we have um, a new icon theme that's now part of the system. But I went far further than that. If you go to the global theme, right, we have our own, well, global theme, as you can see, and it's activated by default on a new Arclix B. Basically, there is a new Arclix B plasma out, right, with some tweaks and things and changes. So we like what we see, right. So the Arclinx Arc Dark Teller is just a click and apply and boom, everything is set. Boom means that. Um, few th changes have been made. So the new Arclinx B, let's think, used to be a white variant, right? We have now a dark variant. That's the main thing that's visual. Quantum is there as well. That's also new. And we've made um, the Quantum Dark here the default. In the Plasma style, we've taken Arc Dark. In the coloring, we've taken Arc Dark. In the window decorations, we've used Arc Dark. Fonts are still the same, 10 in, hit, in, uh, in size, right? Icons, the new icons. And that's just it, right? Just very minimal thing. Uh, the basic stuff, this is all basic and just that particular icon set. We kept to the Babata B, Bata Modern Ice. Launch feedback, not interesting. And the splash screen, we've created a new one. This one is the one from Art Dark. Basically, we just changed the wallpaper, right? Simple as that. But voila, if you want it, it's there. It's another design and we don't want one. So none because it really is on, on fast machines. Just click, flip, but it's gone, right? It's, it's so fast that um, really has no use on fast computers. 
sip of tea. So that's what we've done to the system. In essence, the design, the design has changed. The wallpaper is exactly the same. But if you go to something dark like the, the file manager, then you see that things did change. And all these icons, because of our choice, are different. There's another look. So the papyrus icons, RKDE, are linked together. I split them apart again and let the surfing icons take control over your system, not the papyrus icons. Um, yeah, the last thing maybe is the tweak tool. We've um, understood how KDE works and the Arch Linux tweak tool is now also in black. So if you want that, now it's uniform, Control W is our welcome. So basically everything is in dark. That's the message. Um, don't think I forgot anything. So if you start building now, if you want it now, anybody can have it. People don't realize this, but you can have this ISO right now. Arclinks B ISO. Yeah, better type in the websites at top. Uh, sorry, arclinksb.com. Build your own ISO. Control find. And then we type in plasma. I always say if I can build an ISO, and this is one on the virtual machine, right? You can do too. All you need to do is git clone this thing. Maybe change some new things, Vivaldi extra or Steam extra or whatever, right? And then you run a script and you've got an ISO and you have voila, and the same machine. I have now the same ISO I we're looking at. Simple as that. Voila, the new plasma. Good for July, I guess. Then we'll release it as well. Let's first test it a little bit. All right, cheers.